my dive today, I found this string and then I found a piece of fiberglass. Then I found Brittany's weight belt. Britt, what are you doing without your weight belt? And what else is going on up there? Then I found the top of a can of spam and this absolutely tattered piece of ladies undergarments. Then I found what I thought was an AirPod, but it was actually the thong piece to someone's slippers. Then I found this plastic straw. Good thing I got to it before a turtle did. Oh, gross. Men's boxer shorts. Those are going straight in the garbage bag. Then I found a rubber band and this piece of plastic cord and this ovular piece of plastic. Then I found a single prong to a dingle hopper, a small piece of aluminum, a plastic clip to a bread bag, another piece of plastic. And while I'm picking up these other pieces of plastic, I noticed I found no golf balls at this spot. But last time I was here, I found like a hundred golf balls. Then I found this little piece of a weed whacker, some more of that plastic cord, a crushed piece of plastic tubing, and two more pieces of that plastic cord. Then I found this cone snail and hopefully there's nothing living in it. I'm at the beach, we're going diving. What else is new? When we got in the water, I saw this Kona crab. I asked him if he had any commentary about the socio-political issues facing America right now, and he crept into the sand like woof, 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 woof. Then Brittany told me that she saw something in the pile of Debris at the bottom of the ocean, and she swam down to look at it, and she picked up this dingle hopper. <laughs> you don't know what a dingle hopper is? <laughs> swim in the ocean much a dingle hopper is something that humans use for their hair <laughs> duh you can make all kinds of hairstyles with this thing okay that's all the stuff we saw bye So earlier when Brittany found the dingle hopper, she tried to pick something else up, but she couldn't lift it because it was too heavy. I wanted to go check out what it was and I could just barely see it before her kick stirred up all the dirt and debris. I grabbed onto it and started pulling even though I couldn't see it all. And it was so heavy, but I could feel that I was making a move on it. So I kept pulling. If this isn't a testament to how strong my pullout game is, I don't know what else could be. When the dust and debris settled, I went back down to see what I had pulled out. And it was this massive piece of aluminum. This must've have come from a plane or something. It was so big that I could barely lift it off of the ocean floor, let alone take it back to the beach. I'm gonna have to come back for this thing some other time with some bigger tools. Okay, that's all the stuff we saw. Bye. I'm sure there's a lot of boats that have crashed here. Yeah, go ahead. It's a dingle hopper. The humans use it for their hair. <laughs> On my dive today, we found our octopus friend, Octavius Maximus. He's huge. 
He's so big, I can barely fit him in the frame. Max told me that he wanted to go play with Brittany, so I tried to hand him over, but he wouldn't let go of me. Jeesh, Max, you're so grippy with all those tentacles. We haven't seen him in so long, and it was really nice catching up. Wow, Brittany, Max put his arm on your chest so that he can feel your heartbeat. Right? Right, Max? That's, that's why you're doing that? Right? To feel her heartbeat, right? On my dive today, we found our octopus friend, Octavius Maximus. He looks so cool when he's all spread out and swimming. You can really see the detail of all of his tentacles. Then Max gave Brittany a big hug, and he's so big that his arms wrap all the way around her entire body. Now they're going for a swim together, <laughs> and wow, his arms really are all over her entire body. Hold on tight, Max. Don't let go. Finally, it was time to say goodbye to our friend Max the octopus, and he really turned on the gorilla grip strength and didn't want to let go of her legs and waist. Okay, Max, I really need to put you back in the reef. And then he was like, I'm never letting go. You'll never take me alive. Okay, that's all the stuff we saw. Bye. Thank you.